Hello to everyone. How are you on this Tuesday? This is Joanna and today I am here to share with you some items that I got. My Amazon order came in. My Bath and Body Works candles came in. Candles that I said I was not going to purchase because I did not need any and somehow I managed to go ahead and order eight the day of the sale. Um, and then I want to share with you some things that I found that I have been looking for at Walgreens. Um, I think Walgreens and Walmart is basically where I've been at and please bear with me I cannot see today I had an eye exam and they did that thing where they dilate your eyes and I had to put these little glass things on and I really did have to put them on because um, I never looked it up before but I learned that the dilation can last anywhere from 4 to 24 hours and I, I feel like I can't see and it gave me a bit of motion sickness I usually never have that, but here lately, it's almost like when they mess with my eyes, it affects me some kind of way because it might just be nerves. One, I felt like I couldn't cross the street. The story the last time this happened, y'all heard me say I thought I was going to get hit by a car. Um, secondly, I don't know why I just seem to develop a mild case of motion sickness. Like, I catch the bus there. I had to walk down the street. It wasn't super far, but it was farther than I wanted to go. <laughs> and I actually had to sit down a couple of times. <laughs> so everything is better now. I got me a burger and I got me a soda, which part of the problem was I needed to eat. But I think my eyesight being affected just bugged me a little bit. So I'm going to share with you what I got. But these are the lenses that I got. I went ahead and went with the Air Optics Hydroglide again. Um, I usually don't tend to change the brand of my lenses much. I might ask, but I tend to not like them. I think I had AccuViews a while back. If it wasn't AccuView, it was something that had to do with water. And I really did like it. Like it had water in the package. I do realize this says Hydroglide. But I really did like whatever those were. I used to wear colored lenses. I used to get the um, compliments green and the compliments blue, and they are nothing like the cosmetic lenses. I don't like these little cosmetic lenses that I see, and I wore those, I think, from the time I was maybe 19 until I was about 26, and then I just got tired of them. But what I loved about them, they were prescription one. They measure them to your eye, so when you're moving your eye all about, they're not slipping and sliding. I hate that look of those cosmetic lenses that move when you move your eye. Um, and so if you like colored lenses and you wear prescription lenses, check out the Seba Vision. They still make those because um, there are so many new lens brands, you know, on the market. But the Seba Vision complements green and blue. They have that um, brown in the iris. And a lot of people wouldn't even know I was wearing lenses until they were right up on me and they looked at me. And they said not that they looked like lenses, but they look natural that it didn't even cross their mind until we were looking eye to eye. So they are pretty nice. So what I did yesterday, guys, was I went to Walgreens. Yes, I did. But I do want to say this. This was one of the things that I had hauled that I said I was waiting for that came in from Amazon. This is the Method Yin Yang Cleaner. The lady that I saw that was talking about the Clorox clothing spray and the Tide and all that stuff that I bought from um, Home Depot when I did that cleaning haul, this is what she had. Now, this cost me $20 because I got it off of Amazon. I do believe the normal price is like the same price I paid for that Method Cleaner there. Now, she said this smelled so good and I do agree, but do y'all know what? Since I got this one, I like this one better. So I won't be going on Amazon to get no more of that. Now, if I see it in the store, yes, I will get it. But when I go back to the store, guys, I'm going to get two of these because I really do like it a lot. But I'm going to go ahead and spray this one in the shower. And as you can see, my nozzle came cracked. It didn't affect it, the spray. And I didn't notice it until I was sitting here at the table looking at it. But we'll start with what I got yesterday or do y'all want to see what I got today okay I'll start with this bag back here because what I got yesterday has counterparts I went ahead and got this at Walgreens today I know that some people said that some of these smell better than others I wasn't too particular however I did notice that when I was in Walmart yesterday this was like five dollars four ninety nine I just didn't get it because I was after something else specifically yesterday but today I was in Walgreens I went ahead and got it and I think most of this stuff was on sale I think this was like six something um 
And then the Dial Unscented Body Wash was $3.49. Now, I was going to try the one that I got first because I wanted to make sure that I like it. It's clear like I love, but you know, sometimes it just depends on the slip of the wash and how it is. We know that my favorite one is my Olay Unscented Wash, but I did want to get another one of these in case I liked it because it would prolong that one. This was $3.49, so I now have two of these and that will do me well. And then also today... Let me see. Yeah, that was three. It was three, three forty nine. And then I got my lavender bars. As you can see, I got one right there, my lone one. So I got another little two bar pack of these so that I can have more. And then this right here. And then the last thing I picked up today, I have been unsuccessful in locating the Caress um, Brazilian Gardenia Coconut Milk Bars. I smelled this. This is the one that I smelled in Walgreens that I ended up liking. And so I went ahead and just got one. They had three, so I went ahead and got one. And that's all that I got from Walgreens today. So yesterday I went to Walgreens, guys, and I found this. They had one. I got online. I don't know why I didn't do it sooner. They clearance this out, guys, to $3.79, but I didn't know that. I thought it was still the five or the six something. I go in there. I'm disheartened because I couldn't find it. They had this one and two pomegranate ones. And I would have got them if I would have known that, you know, all three of them were $3.79. But I was after this one. This is the hardest one to find. So I think. I have one of each one, I think. We will see. So, whereas before y'all had heard me say that I was going to put this and this Dove Cream with the Lavender Tree Hut one, now that I have the counterparts, I have the cream, I have the scrub, and I have the soap. So, these will do, and then I'll mix that other one in and through. And so the next thing I got from Walgreens was I saw this. Now, I had seen people talking about the um, cocoa butter, is it whatever the intensive one is in the brown. I already had two of those guys and forgot. But I got this because I haven't been seeing these. And these are great for men, your boys, your sons. Something to put in their little gym bag or just at school in the wintertime. So I had to get this because I hadn't seen these and they were just a dollar. So I did get one. I did want to get a few more. And because I had heard LaToya talking about this, even though I hate spray deodorant, I went ahead and got this. In the summertime when it's hot, sometimes a burst of spray deodorant is nice. But my preferred deodorant is solid, which, as you can guess... I went ahead and got a solid as well. And then one of the other things that I found was this because I had hauled this a while back, but I did not have the counterpart because they had the rose set in Target when I got this, but they did not have this set together. So now I have these two, so they go together. So the main reason, guys, that I went out to Walmart to begin with was I was online, as you can see, looking for scrubs. I had two of these and I ate one. <laughs> I did. I ate one yesterday. So what I found in Walmart yesterday that I was not looking for was this firming sugar with caffeine, mocha, and coffee beans. So the one that I'm after now, if I don't get any other ones, is the mojito. They had one lone one of these in there, so I went ahead and got it. And the main thing I went out there for, guys, was these scrubs are getting harder and harder to find and people are selling them at astronomical prices. So I looked on the Walmart site and I picked the one for the local store locator and they said they had seven of these. I would have bought more, but I just wanted two. So I do have one already. So we're going to see here. I do think that I have all the scrubs. So I got the brown sugar and coconut butter and I did pick up two of those. Okay. And then as you can see here, this should be the one that I already had. And you see the labels are different, but this should be, so I got three of those. And then I got a, another pomegranate because it was my goal to have two of each one, along with the pomegranate that I already have. Again, a label change. So we'll put those right there. I got another rice milk and macadamia. Now, y'all know I hauled this before these things took off on social media. I hauled mine 
If it wasn't last year, it might have been the season before that. And then I just finished that first jar now. So I bought this as a backup. But then I had turned around and got a second one. So I have two of those. And y'all know that I also have the body cream to that somewhere. And I intend to use it with the Method Rice Milk and Coconut Wash. Then I was able to get this one in a kit. I think somebody is selling these or selling them in groups of three or four. But I was able to get this one because other than the lavender, this was the next hardest one to find. And these were the same ones that someone got at my job. I think they thought they were body butters. And at the time, though, you know, they weren't selling out. So I do have two of these and I cannot find the second one. But I will get another one of these. And this is the crushed almond and mango butter. So that's one, two, three, four, five. And then this one. So I do believe I have all seven. If there are seven. Now this one right here is the Kaleidal Oatmeal and Calendula Oil. I did not get two of these when I seen it. I don't even remember where I hauled it from. I'm going to have to go back through my videos. So I have one of these. One of these. Two of these. I now have two of those. Two of these. Which I will get more of this when I see it. And then three of these and one lavender. So... I do believe, guys, that I am set on body scrubs. Now, I do plan to use these in the summer. These two in particular for the summer, yes. The calendula and the regular one, yes. I will use one of these, but I may hold these out for the fall and winter months. Not that they are for that, but I just, I really want to savor these. But at the same time, I do want to use them. It is not my intent to let them sit and get old. Because as y'all know, that's part of, my, part of my problem. My stash is so huge that... It takes me a while to get around to things. So the next thing that I got, and I think I might have this already. I just don't know where they are. And it's okay that I have more. And I also have the body wash to this is the Green Clay Purifying Detox Dove Bars. And then I also went ahead and got this. So I will incorporate this with the tree hut lavender and then i will probably get the lavender body butter to that and just incorporate it all throughout mix and match what have you but i went ahead and got this one because this was the one that i wanted the most so in these y'all know that i have the blue the tan and this one i don't need the pink one so i think the next things that i got guys was the shower storage and i'm gonna take you in there to see my shower because it's small but with all this shower storage stuff i do plan on getting acrylic shower storage as well on the 15th i'm going to be placing another order as well as my nespresso order these little things right here are the little nail art roses when i get my hands together and get to doing my french looks and using that gel polish i want to have these on hand so these were hard to order i tried ordering these um last year and every time i would place an order for these they were stripped from my order and they were taken out and then of course i was able to get the whipped pomegranate and shea butter body cream which will go with the pomegranate scrub now right now what i have in there is i'm going to be using some of my older scrubs and i'm going to share that with you when we go in the bathroom because y'all heard me say that the oils are kind of rancid so this is the shower storage that i got and this will work better than the one that i had because i sold the one that i had to a co-worker at work this is the straight kind that just go up on the shower wall because see my corners in the bathroom aren't like that you'll see when we get in there now the hampy one that i wanted they sold out of and then I think the acrylic one, I'm trying to decide if I want another one of these because I don't want too much in there. But I would like the Hampy one, one of these, the little rack that I plan on hanging in there, deciding whether or not I want a second rack in the acrylic storage. I just want one set of the acrylic storage and I'll share that with you when I get it because I'm really hoping and praying they don't sell out before I order it on the 15th. So we'll go in the bathroom. And I'll show you that a little bit first, and then I'll come back and share with you the candles that I got from Bath and Body Works. This is a shower head, or the inside of it. You're going to see this is missing because I put it in some clear to try to clean it out. These are the three products that I plan on using up. That's not all, but this is the oldest Bath and Body Works item that I have. 
besides the there's the glow salt rub and it's still holding up i love it but i'm gonna use it on up when i find it too this goes to the mango butter that i haven't touched i also have the bars to this boxed up i need to find and this i thought was open but it's not but i'm gonna go ahead and use it now instead of waiting for cooler weather because oils go rancid really really fast and i don't want anything to happen to that before i can use it up because they're newer scrubs even though this one is older, their newer scrubs are kind of like this. They're that softer, um, you know, variety. So this is the shower. It's very small. Um, this is the piece that I took out so that I can go ahead and try to clean it. Um, I don't know anything about changing shower heads, so I'm going to leave that alone. Um, I would ask, but there's no point because whatever I put in here, as far as shower heads or things like that, I wouldn't be taking them with me when I moved. But as you can see, I had 32 open bottles of shower gel in here, so I plan to target all of that. Um, and the scrub that I am going to be using is going to be this tree hut one here right now next because i have the wash and the cream to that open the butter but what i wanted to share with you in here i do like that little handlebar there but see these corners i thought that i was going to be able to use that shower storage see it's not a normal corner like up there and i can't put it up there but i thought that i was going to be able to use the first one that i got and i couldn't because of that so what i plan on doing is either putting that rack here to see where it goes or if i like it there then I might put a second one here with that shower hook. But on this wall right here, I plan to put the ones that I showed you today. And then I want to put the hampy ones that I want to order. And then maybe along right here, I want to put the acrylic. Because that acrylic one is designed to put things upside down. Where I plan to put my bigger, biggest bottles of wash or gel but mainly shampoo and conditioner. It holds them upside down so you can get them out. Somewhere along here, I plan to put that little soap dish that I got. I want to put one for when I'm standing, which will probably be that clear acrylic one, maybe. Or I'll put the silver one up there. And then I also want to have one for when you're sitting. Now, what I don't like is, as you can see, this is not a deep tub. This tub is no bigger than the one in my other apartment. Like a lot of people are doing now with their staycations and everything, when we would go out of town and we would get a hotel room, I would always enjoy the tubs there. So it was one of the reasons I always kept nice bath salts and nice bubble baths. And by nice, I mean my expensive ones. Back when I was using the perfume bubble baths and body creams and things like that because it's just a luxurious feeling and you get those nice deep tubs when you go to the hotels. But... For the most part this will do but i plan on fixing it up in here and everything i'm going to put in here i can take down so because i learned of a lot of the shower storage here on youtube and then found some things of my own i think it's going to work out pretty nicely but i plan to clean this shower a little bit more i want to take that clorox cleanup and just go over these walls because i'm going to have to rub the areas that I want to hang things down with in alcohol and do all that. So like I said, it won't be yet. Um, I don't know if I'll try to attach those one things. I want to wait till I get everything together. So when I get the hampy ones and when I get the acrylic ones, and then that way I can place and see how I want it rather than tack it up there now. But we'll go and see what candles I got next. Okay, let's see here since I don't remember. Now if I had something where I could just rip this up like right just rip this up they need to quit sending this stuff stop sending that mess so we have three six eight candles let's see what i got i did not really need or want any candle that i got um y'all i think it was just me wanting to order but i did get one i think i didn't have the lemon one and i went ahead and got that plus we're going to see how these candles are so I did get another Be Mine, because I think I just have one. I did want two, so that part wasn't a problem. And here it is. I knew that I got the blueberry, and I went ahead and got the lemon. But in all honesty, guys, we know that I don't need any candle that I got. I don't really need too much of anything. So I got the lemon pop. So if all of these come out of here okay and undamaged, I'm going to be really, really happy. I may exchange one of these out i don't know yet i got the bubbly rose 
because I do want the entire Sunset Mimosa set. Since I um, don't have any at all, I will go ahead. And when we get that tote bag, y'all know that I shared years ago, I shared how you could exchange everything in there out. I will be exchanging that big candle in there for the Sunshine Mimosa candle if we have it. Or if we don't have it till before or after, I'll just buy it and then wait for a candle sale. So as you can see there, I got the Tropical Spice. Now, I did want to make sure I got another one of these. This is a pleasant, nice, light scent. Because for the most part, every candle that I got, I actually want. So unless I just don't like something, um, I got the pineapples and pancakes. I smelled this in the store. I liked it. Already know what this is about. We know that I like it. Um, this one will be a new one for me. We will see. The Tropical Spice will be a new one for me. We will see. We know that I want this lemon cake pop. Anything that smells like lemon buttercream is welcome here. So let me see what else I got. Because sometimes that's the fun if you forget what you got. They are certainly making this hard to open. We have this one. I didn't want to not get this one. So if I don't like something, it'll be one of these three. But this one is the Blueberry Lavender Spritzer. So I wanted to make sure that I got that one. But if I don't like any of these three, then I will exchange one. And here, whipped coffee. So I didn't get the banana cabana. I thought that I did, but I know that I wanted that whipped coffee. So, yeah. So these are the ones that I got because I have detained you guys long enough. And for the most part, I'm very pleased with them all. So this is it. This is everything that I got. <laughs> So until the next time, everyone have a great day. Thank you for joining me here. Thank you for subscribing. If you're new, please hit that subscribe button. Hopefully you enjoy my content. I do do shopping a little bit of everywhere, but I have yet to buy some real groceries. So again, until the next time, everyone have a great day.